And we know that if we're looking down on this, let's see, let me change this again. All right, so we're seeing the front of this here. Here's our, this is the, this is our hip. We've got our jacks in here. So we need to find out what the difference in this jack and that jack is. So it's, it's kind of freaky if you look at it. Kind of weird. All right. So because these, oh, on it. Because these are 24 inches on center, then if we look at it from the side, in other words, I'm looking at it this way. If I'm looking at it the side, these are going to be 24 inches on center. And this roof is a 10 and 12. Then if you think about it, since these move over 24 inches, it actually goes up twice as much as this because this is a per foot. So this is going to be 20 inches here. All right, so let's come back over on our calculator. All right, so I'm going to take 24 squared plus 20 squared equals, and I'm going to find the square root of that, 31.24. That is 31.24 or 31 uh, and a quarter inches. All right, so it's it's awful close there. All right, so it works out to about 31 and a quarter inches. So that mean that means that this one is going to be 31 and a quarter inches shorter than this one here. So if we go back, if I close that, I did nope. There it is. Uh, so we go back and we have our common at 15 feet 7 and 7 eighths and we need to subtract that from it so let's go over here I'm going to uh, I'm going to save that number there and I'm going to go back and I'm going to put in this number here so 7 divided by 16 equals plus 7 equals uh, divided by 12 equals plus 15 equals times 12. All right, so that's 187.4375, which is pretty much closer to that. Let's go back and let's just, let's just do it this way. Let's do it, let's do it the way we had it. 12, or 10 squared plus 12 squared equals square root. We've got this big old long number here. We're going to multiply it by our 12 foot times 12 foot equals 187.45. That's the number we're looking for. Sorry about that. All right. So, and now we're going to subtract that difference in length, which was this number here. And that's going to give us 156.20 J1 156.20 and then we're going to subtract that again to end up with 124.96 and again 93.72 93.72 and again 62.48 and so forth and so forth and so forth and so forth. Then what we'll have to do is we'll have to come back and change these out to feet and inches. So 156.2 uh, divided by 12 is 13 less 13 equals times 12 equals 0.02 so that's 
zero inches feet inches zero inches times 16 equals 3 sixteenths all right so you would have to go through and do all of that to each one of those to find the difference in each one of those jacks there so that is now I hope you get a handle on why I like the construction calculator so well so anyway that's how you do it longhand. I hope this helps out. If you have any questions, you know what to do. Give me a text, and I will talk to you guys later.